Hi guys, Daniel here, and in this video, we're going to discuss how you can set up texting, phone call, and email services in Go High Level. We'll walk you through everything step by step so that you can get these features up and running smoothly. But before we begin, if you're new to Go High Level and you want to sign up, use my link in the description below to get a 30 day free trial instead of the standard 14 days. You'll also get access to the Go High Level course for free, which will guide you through how to make the most of the platform. Now, let's get back to the video. To begin with, we're going to focus on setting up calling and texting. So to add a number, first switch to your Go High Level sub account. And once you're in the sub account, click on settings at the bottom of the left menu. After that, click on phone numbers within the settings menu. Now this will take you to the phone system dashboard where you can manage all your phone numbers. To add a new number, click on the add number button and you'll see three options appear in the drop down menu. Now since we want to add a phone number, click on the add phone number option. A pop up window will appear where you can choose your country. Currently, we have the United States set up by default, but you can search and select the country that you're in. So once you've selected your country, you'll be provided with a list of phone numbers to choose from. Now, these phone numbers come from different locations within your selected country. For example, since we chose the United States, the numbers will be from various regions across the country. Simply pick the number that best suits your requirements based on the location, and you'll see the monthly cost listed next to each number. Now, it's worth noting that these phone numbers can make calls, send messages, and even support MMS. After selecting your desired number, click on the Proceed to Buy button at the bottom right of the pop-up window to finalize your purchase. Now, once you've purchased the number, you, you will receive a confirmation message. After that, click on the verify this toll free number button at the bottom. You will then need to fill in your business and contact information, including your legal entity name, website URL, first and last name, email address, country code, and phone number. So once you've filled out all of these details, click on continue to business location. So in the next step, you'll need to provide information about your business location, enter your country, state, address, city, and postal or zip code. After that, click on continue to messaging use case button. Finally, in the messaging use case section, provide further details such as estimated monthly volume, opt-in type, use case categories, opt-in workflow image URLs, and use case description and message content. So once all the information is entered, agree to the terms of service by clicking on the checkbox and then click on the send information for verification button. Now, one important note is that you can set up different phone numbers for each of your sub accounts and they will be integrated through the lead connector system. Now, this setup is super convenient if you're managing multiple businesses or clients under one Go High Level account. So each client or sub account can have its own dedicated number for better organization and easier management. So if you run a SaaS business and you have clients using your platform, you can actually charge your clients for the text messages that they send and the calls that they make. Now, this means that instead of absorbing the cost yourself, you can pass on those expenses to your clients as part of your service. Now, this is an incredible way to add extra revenue streams to your business, especially if your clients are heavy users of the texting and calling features. Next, let's move on to setting up email services. First, go to your sub account and click on settings, then navigate to email services. Now, in the past, Go High Level used Mailgun to handle your emails, but now they have their own service called Lead Connector, which makes the process a lot easier. So we'll be using Lead Connector to get everything set up. So to get started, you'll need to select a dedicated domain and click on dedicated domain and IP to go to the dedicated domain page. From there, click on the add domain button and enter your domain name. For this example, let's use replies.speakaboutdigital.info. Next, you'll need to update your DNS settings from the domain that you purchased. Your DNS hosting provider 
could be platforms like Cloudflare or GoDaddy. Now, after you have entered the domain name, click Add and Verify. Now, it's normal for the domain to not be verified immediately, but don't worry. Go High Level will give you specific instructions on what needs to be done in your DNS settings. If you want to add the records manually, click on Add Record Manually. Now, let's go through adding the different types of records that you'll need. TXT, CNAME, and MX. Now, these records are important to verify your domain and to make sure that your emails work properly. Adding DNS records can seem a bit technical, but it's not too difficult once you understand what each record does and why it's important. So first, let's talk about the TXT or the text. So a TXT record is a type of DNS entry that provides text information to external sources often used to verify domain ownership. When you add a text record, you prove that you own the domain by adding a specific code that Go High Level gives you. Now, this step is important because it makes sure that emails sent from your domain are seen as trustworthy, which helps prevent them from ending up in a spam folder. Next is the CNAME record. The CNAME record acts as an alias that links one name to another. In this case, it tells email providers where to find your email service, connecting your domain to Go High Level's lead connector email system. It's like setting up a signpost to direct traffic to the right address, making sure that your emails reach their destination without any issues. Then we have the MX record, which stands for mail exchange. So MX records tell email servers where to deliver your incoming emails. By adding the MX records provided by Go High Level, you'll make sure that your domain is set up correctly to receive these emails. Now, this helps incoming messages get to the right server, making sure that they are delivered properly. Once you've added these records to your DNS settings, click on Verify Records. It might take some time for everything to update, so don't worry if it doesn't verify immediately. DNS changes can sometimes take a few minutes to a few hours to fully propagate across the internet. After successfully adding the records manually, you can proceed with the verification process. And once all the records are verified, your email service will be active, meaning that you can start sending emails from your chosen domain. If you're managing multiple sub-accounts in Go High Level, remember that you'll need to repeat this process for each dedicated domain that you want to use. Each sub-account can have its own email domain, which makes it much easier to keep communications organized and manage different clients or businesses separately. So that's it, everyone. You've now learned how to set up texting, calling, and email services in Go High Level. This setup will make managing client communications super easy and keep everything organized in one place. If you haven't already signed up for Go High Level, remember to use my link in the description below. You'll get a 30-day free trial instead of the standard 14 days, plus you're going to get access to my free Go High Level Jumpstart course. It's a great way to get started and make the most of the platform. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next video.